What's up? It's me, your boy, Jergunza, and in today's video, I'm gonna do a little bit of a commentary for it, so it's not so boring for you. So basically, I, not this match right here that you're seeing, this is just to pass up time to, before we get to the match. Uh, yesterday, I fought a Raiden player, right? And I'm just trying to rank up, basically. I'm not really trying to play my heart out. I'm just trying to rank up a bit. I only played like, I think, three matches yesterday. I saw I just need to get like a few points to get to, I think it was Warrior. Anywho, I come across this Raiden player and I don't really think he's bad. I felt like he didn't know how to play. Like he's still new to the game. I don't know. I didn't really feel like he was someone that was just trash. He just didn't really know how to react to someone who's... I'm not trying to gloat, but as skillful as I am, which I'm not saying I'm a great player by any means. I'm just saying by someone more experienced, I don't think he's really faced anyone experienced yet. I might be wrong. Who knows what he does after the match is over? Like you'll see it's insane to me, like because he did hit my DMs up. So, yeah, let's just get to the match. I've been talking long enough now. Let's go ahead and get to it. All right, so as you can see, I'm playing Sub-Zero with my Goro cameo. He's playing Ra uh, Raiden with Serena. You know. So as I say, he was really doing nothing impressive. Uh, what I'm doing is basically just basic shit. I'm over here dropping combos because once again, I'm not really paying attention, and also, I'm not that great to where I can just make these combos work on command whenever I want. I'll admit right now, I'll tell anyone that I am not that great of a player. I play this game to have fun, which I guess I'm having a bit of sometimes on this game. I don't know. Um, as you see, this dude is doing kind of just the same basic shit. You know, nothing really impressive, so I just kind of got the feeling... I had got the impression that the dude is kind of new and he's like just trying to figure the game out. That's why he's doing whatever. Now, the thing he complained about was that I was doing too many grabs. And I mean, I did a lot more than just grabs on here, but I guess you can say I grabbed him too much if you want to think that, whatever. But my thing was, I. I I didn't do that. I did more combos than grabs on here, basically. Even though I dropped that, I still managed to do more than just grabs. Man, just re-looking at this, this dude is honestly so ass. I'm not even trying to gloat. I'm not perfect myself. But jeez, this dude... It's just crazy because how he had the, the audacity to just text me. Alright. Match is over. You know, we're about to go to round three, right? Round three? Nope. He leaves. And he messages me. Spamming grab because you're trash at the game. And I responded with this. You're over here complaining. Meanwhile, you need to get better at the game. If you were better than me, you would fucking beat me. If I'm so trash, how am I beating you? What does that say about you, bro? What does that say about you? At the end of the day, you rage quit, and I got it on footage, too. You left. You couldn't handle me. You suck. If I'm trash, you must be ultimate trash. You must be trash water, the bottom of the barrel. He, of course, texts me back saying, but you need to spam to win. What does that say about you, bruh? I don't really know what he thinks spamming is, but I most definitely was not spamming. If anything, he was just kind of spamming that back two over and over again every chance he got. You are playing one of the most carried characters on this game, yet you still couldn't beat my most, the most weakest character on this game, the slowest character on this game. Yet you're playing the fastest character on this game. He then responds to me saying, nobody follows you. I seen YouTube, barely got any followers. I okay, whatever. I guess you know, I'm doing this for fun. But it's what he, what he says not too long after this. What cracks me up? It's the message after the next one, basically. 
And don't act like I was just grabbing you. I got the footage to prove that I was doing combos on your ass too. But you probably don't know nothing about that since you didn't accomplish one. So don't come at me with that shit. So then he responds with saying, I see you don't know how to spell, poor guy. I guess your parents didn't teach you well. Well, I mean, I don't know what he's talking about because I did go search my YouTube to see what the hell he's talking about. And nothing on my YouTube is misspelled or nothing like that, except for when I put combos on the title of my videos, I put a, C, a K instead of a C. And if you're a Mortal Kombat fan, then you will understand why that K is, a, you know, a K, not a C. Because Mortal Kombat, you know, they spell combat with the with a K. I know, which further makes me think that this dude is new to the world of Mortal Kombat. I don't know. I don't think he's realized yet that Mortal Kombat is spelled with a K and not a C. And I guess your mother didn't teach you how to take L's, huh? Man, that's a damn shame. Like I said, you over here doing all this stupid shit, yet you didn't get one win. You left on your own decision. I'm better than you. Suck a dick. And this is what got me going. I... I was gonna make a video, not even after this message. This message is not the reason why I'm making the video. The reason why I'm making this video will come after I'm done with these messages. It's cause it's not even the messages that made me wanna make a video on this guy. But this dude said, I know you're trying hard. You're trying to be the next Sonic Fox or Ninja Killer, but you will never be that because you're trash. And there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. And there you have it. I'm going to go ahead and let these messages play off. And then I will say my statement after. You, I'm not going to lie. You made me laugh with that one. Don't nobody care about that fucking Sonic Fox and Ninja Killer. The people who got Sub-Zero nerfed in the first place. I'm trying to beat myself and yet you over here hating because you suck. Something clearly is not going on right in your life which is why you're trying to bash me so you can feel validation for yourself and the decisions that you've made. And I hope whatever it is that you're going through, you fix it. I hope you get better in life. Until then, do not message me until you want a first to five. Cause I will pick a different character and I won't have to grab you to win. I swear I won't have to grab you. So don't message me unless you want first to five. So after I sent those messages to him, he went completely dark on me, didn't say nothing to me. I was like, oh, okay, I guess he doesn't want to do a first five. I don't know. Maybe the message just got to him where I said, maybe he got a life. Maybe he went to go do something. Maybe he found something of value to do. But no, no, now I know why he didn't message me. Because this man reported my messages. And the only reason why I sent voice messages is because on the PlayStation 4, I noticed how easy it is for people to suspend, like report and get you suspended for sending certain texts or just texts in general. If it's any text whatsoever, it was able to get reported and get you suspended. So I stopped sending messages and I realized that voice messages do not get reported at all. They don't get me suspended whatsoever. And it's worked for a very long time. Not on the PlayStation 5 apparently. I am now suspended for 30 days. And not from online. I can still play online and do online exclusive things. However, I am, a, I am suspended for 30 days from talking to people. But after this experience, I'm turning my messages off. Uh, these people will have the nerve to come in your DMs and talk a gargantuous pile of shit to you. And then when you clap back at them and they get somewhat offended from what you say to them... They have the nerve to report you as if you were being the bully the whole time. As if you enforced this negativity into their lives and not the other way around. These people are clowns. This dude, Lord Littlefoot6, is a clown. And I'm not sure if someone else reported him from the community post I made about him. If a bunch of people reported him. But I can't find this account now. It doesn't exist apparently. Even my other accounts, his name does not pop up. So I'm assuming people reported to him and maybe his shit got deleted. Who knows? And if so, you guys are a win community and I love you all. Pauls. Well, it's been your boy Jared Gunza. Take care. Have a good day. Um, sorry this is a long ass video, but whatever.